hi everyone welcome to the channel aries the emperor here back with another general reading for my aries collective if you are new here welcome this is an all aries channel for all aries placements cross watchers you are welcome love just take in mind that this reading may or may not resonate with everyone so do not force the reading okay place the gender roles where they need to be for you this is energy energy is all fluid all right, so you guys know what day it is. Um, this is your next seven days, give or take, for the collective. Um, these last couple readings have been going off, you know, and I feel like this one may be no different. Okay, you read the title. Um, so we're going to get right on into it. You know, you hit them where the fuck it hurts. And sometimes that is necessary. You know what I'm saying? Somebody, sometimes pe people do get beside themselves. You know, and you are one to keep it quiet and keep it cute and on mute. You know, you let a motherfucker hang themselves for all you care. Um, but when it starts to affect you, you know, that's when you got to put your hand up. You know, and sometimes you don't even have to say anything. You know, you just separating yourself alone speaks volumes because your energy is so strong. When you remove it, it's like opening up the front door on a winter day. You know, they're going to feel that shit. It's going to feel real cold when that energy, you know, leaves the room here. All right, let's get into it, though. Let's just see in general uh, what messages come out for the collective. All right. Thank you guys to everyone who likes and subscribes to the channel. Thank you for your donations. Every dollar counts. Um, you guys, thank you to those who book readings and shop the vegan soy candle shop. Um, I am, I have reached out to a, a quite a few of you um, regarding readings for some odd reason. I don't know if you guys are on the same, like same timeline. I have not received responses. Uh, so this is uh, my final attempt. Um, so, you know, send me your information so that we can connect as far as your readings go. To those who have um, re responded back, I have sent out readings too, okay? As well as candle orders um, that I will be sending right after I upload this video, okay? So if you'd like to connect with me, guys, um, or shop the Vegan Soy Candle Shop, I am going to be running a sale here soon. I have a very special announcement, a few a few announcements for the collective and for my members as well, okay? Um, so just stay tuned, guys. Thank you for hanging in here with me and being a part of this collective. Y'all mean the world to me, like Tony Braxton said. I swear the only thing that matters, that's to me. The full car, you, baby, Aries, baby. Okay, I know I'm not I'm not singing on cue, but that ain't the point. Okay, it's coming from the heart. That's the point. All right, and that's the energy, you know, that you putting out there. Like I mentioned here, you, how can you forget a damn fool? And I ain't calling you no fool, but I'm just saying, like somebody with this type of energy, um, you just airy, you out there, you pack light, you look like a good time, you look like you're optimistic, you look like you're not a follower, like you have some crazy ideas and some shit to bring to the table here in the next seven days, just in general in life, you know what I'm saying? So somebody's going to feel it when you exit stage left, you know, when they thought they was the star and you had to quietly um, do a curtain call on their ass and, and move and remove yourself and leave them out there. Yeah, this is that type of energy here for somebody, you know, and you have done all that you can do, you know, in a situation here. It's time for something new, a new beginning, you know, um, not to say that you're going to do something spontaneous. I feel like somebody out there may be doing something spontaneous and but not without good reason. I'm going to say this, like I feel like you're dotting your I's and you're crossing your T's in the next seven days before you actually jump out there. You know, you're not just going off the cliff. Um, but I do feel like you are work, walking with faith, working um, with God, you know, with spirit, with the universe. You are learning to be more specific. You know, you've taken the superpowers with you that you act, that activated you from the super moon here. The last super moon of the year. Big Aries energy is what you are carrying with you here the next seven days um, to set you up. You know, just as you trusting in life um, and, and starting to get some pleasure out of it. 
but not at the expense of nobody else here. You're not finna let nobody come up in here and rain on your parade, put you in your head about it, play mental games with you here, you know, try and make you feel less than. Cause like I said, you know, even though somebody might feel like they got more than you, they know more than you, they look better than you, they dress better than you, they smile harder than you, they, you know, they can do a cartwheel better than you. Like somebody is so the fuck what? You can't do a cartwheel like this bitch. You know what I'm saying? And that's what the full card says. And this is why they up in they head in the next seven days here, give or take. You know what I'm saying? Because it's you and no one else. Okay. And they can't confuse you out of that energy of being you. You're hitting them where it hurts. You're living in their head rent free. You got a condo in that bitch. Okay. You know, somebody's upset or they, they regretting what they did because now they want to play victim, you know, because now the table's done turned just a little bit for you here in the next seven days, give or take. Not a little bit. I mean, a, a big bit, bitch. <laughs> I didn't mean to say the bitch part, but it just, it came with, <laughs> it came with it. Um, but nonetheless, I meant to say big Aries energy. All right. There's more of that coming out. Like this is. And at that, I really feel like somebody is you, you're the, the, you're the emperor here. And somebody is the damn fool that tried to play you, be you, imitate you, trick you out your spot. Um, just, it's just feeling like it's giving vibes of somebody wanted to come together with you for all the wrong reasons or, um, is, is, is trying to. Um, make some type of move towards you, get closer to you in some way, shape, or form, because it feels like you're getting further away um, physically, mentally, emotionally. There's a detachment here, um, and you finding your ways. You know what I'm saying? The leader in you is leading in the next seven days here. Um, and you focusing on um, a bigger picture, I feel like. And, and you seeing the power within yourself here in the next seven days. Um, and you being more of an authoritative figure, whether you speaking up for yourself more in a situation at work, in your relationship, in your family, you not being respected. Speak up. You the motherfucking emperor for God's sakes here in the next seven days. But you know what? You don't have to do it in a mean way or a condescending way or any type of way here. You just, you're doing it to where when you show up, the energy is felt, the message is um, conveyed and they get it. And it's a respect after that, after that, a mutual agreement. You know what I'm saying? I feel like it is what you leading with here in the next seven days here. You not to be played with. The emperor is, is definitely going to hit your ass where it hurts and has good reason and is skilled at it. So it's going to hurt trust just like i mentioned when that aries leave your life it's gonna hurt it's gonna linger and you're gonna wish you had access back into that palace in some way shape or form here somebody out here lost in the next seven days because they tried to play with you once again and the real emperor had to stand the fuck up get disciplined in the next seven days here. Somebody could be spending time with their father. The Hierophant. This is Taurus energy. You know, somebody kissed on the forehead by God. And when I say that, that's you here in the next seven days. You may have a, a near-death experience, um, but nonetheless, it's just, it's just going to be that. I can't even talk today. I feel like my throat chakra is blocked. Um, the Hierophant is like God. You know, either you getting some clear message that's about to change something, set something up for you, um, or just literally you getting closer to God, closer to spirit, you know, closer to your origins. Less is more. You know, you, you, you're simplifying things in your life so that you can um, continue to discipline yourself and, and maybe up something here that you're working on. You know, you're being consistent in what you're doing because that's what the Hierophant is. This is somebody who was looked up to. This is a teacher, you know, somebody that may want to come to you for advice in a crisis that they may be experiencing at this time. That's what the emperor and the hair find is wise as hell. You know, so you well respected with this energy. And not only that, this is meditation. 
All right. I definitely see someone doing that this weekend. And you may be an enlightening someone here as well here. Feel like someone may be curious about your spirituality here in the next seven days here and may reach out and ask you about that. I feel like you tested somebody's faith here as well here. Or like I said here, you know, somebody thought the fool was you and they found out real quickly or they're going to find out real quickly that they the real, the real damn fool. Catch my drift. Page of Pentacles is what you don't see coming. Either somebody immature, somebody that don't measure up, um, or, or just somebody that's... The actual fool. All right, what other messages, Spirit? I didn't want to make this reading long. Look at this, the sun. Oh, Mr. Sun, sun, Mr. Golden Sun. <laughs> Please shine down on me. And it's shining down on you, the Aries, literally. You know, it gets no clearer. Your vision is going to get very clear. Something is coming to the light for you. Somebody could be getting married or engaged, um, or somebody could be solidifying a relationship, making it more serious. Um, I also feel like this is you, like this is that warmth that you bring. Okay. That's what the sun brings, right? Warmth. So like I mentioned in the beginning of the reading, you know, when you take that away, what's left? Shade. You know, and if ain't no, and if, if it's not enough sun, you know, it, it, it turns cold. So this is you celebrating. I feel like someone as well here in the next seven days, give or take. This is happiness, um, raw, authentic happiness. Um, Many. it's like all is well okay don't be so hard on yourself and definitely don't give up yeah judgment and magician it don't get no clearer than this you know when this type of energy enters into the reading you know this is literally the divine you know blowing trumpets um, awakening you, you know, letting you know, like literally here, you are not one of the left behind. You are one of the chosen, um, and you have not been forgotten. You know what I'm saying? Um, be clearing your intentions here in the next seven days, um, and, and be clearing in those wanting to be around you, you know, because it may not be for good reason. This is illusions and games as well. And it's by the best of them, the best narcs, narcissists, manipulators here. You know what I'm saying? Wanting to play on you just to test you, you know, just to see if you are about what you say you about, just to see if you're going to give in, you know, just to see if you're going to get caught slipping here. And this is in any situation you at work, you out with your friends, you know, anybody um, we could be playing on you mentally, you know, because this by the term is called friend of me. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But at the same time here, um, you have been given insight here in the next seven days give or take with the sun here this is double confirmation this is clarity um and any games and illusions that come up against you will be revealed just as quick you know um and this is also i feel like the divine also reminding you you know of your power um of your resources um of your capabilities um what you are able to manifest out of nothing into something you know and and you just like i mentioned here being clear in your intentions here um and getting started in something baby you got a, a year and a half open window it's open season for the entire collective um you would be crazy you know not to give it your best go here or give these you know at least this next year and a half, two years, um, the best run that you can give it because that's what all of this here means. And the fool, like I've been saying, is literally the one um, that's going through all these experiences, through all of these characters and these figures in the Zodiac, 
in this tarot in this tarot deck here. So that screams volumes, man. It's three ma almost majors out here, you know, especially for the Aries collective here with the the fool. These are three different transitions of you, sides to you, um, abilities to you. So like put them to use. They all you, you know. You don't have to pick a side, you know. Just find a healthy balance in that Libra energy, you know, and um, and find your alignment. You know, and don't be afraid to shine in that. You know, you was put here for a reason. If you got a talent, use that fucking talent. You know what I'm saying? Don't let people, um, and I know you, you Aries, you're not going to do that, but you don't care about attention in a lot of instances. And a lot of you have a lot more to offer than you realize. But, um, I'm going to leave this reading here. Okay. Who I feel like that was a, a mouthful. That entire reading. Hit that like and subscribe button for more messages from me. I love you guys. Um, I'll catch you later. Ciao.